Hello and welcome back to my channel. I hope you are really enjoying the series. So in this tutorial you are going to be looking at histogram equalization. So we'll just go about the process then I will explain what it does at the end. So go to radiometric and select histogram equalization. For histogram equalization we only need one scene that is the Landsat 8 that you had stacked. So select it and then give it the output. So it's a quick and easy step, just straightforward. So let's give it the output name and then you can save that. Okay. So we can just leave the other parameters as default and click OK. So as the process continues, I will now explain what histogram equalization is. So this is a type of um, correction whereby you are using a, you are using a linear function to, to unify the frequency for every pixel. That is, for example, you can use, um, let's say you can use an equation. There is a specific equation for histogram equalization, which you use. And it's in the form of maybe, let's say, a line that it passes through the origin. So in the process of histogram equalization, all of the pixels that exist, all of the frequencies of the pixels, are they are uniformed to that equation. So that's histogram equalization. I will now speed up the process and give it time to... Um, finish so let's do that quickly then you can proceed so once that is done just close that and then now we'll open a new 2d view to compare the imagery so create a new 2d view then add the raster layer so we're going to add it wherever you saved it import it then click ok and fit the layer to the window so um as you can see now the image looks quite better and easier to interpret the visual appearance of the image is appealing as you can see the image on the right is after equalization and on the left it's before equalization so we can also um you can also notice the the brightness so let's view the metadata um let's view the metadata for both of the two of the scenes so go to metadata and you're going to select both of them okay so we have that one the first one And then it's just hanging, but it's okay. So let's view the histogram. That's the initially. Then now let's view the histogram after equalization. Let's put it on the side. And then let's open also the initial one and view. You can see the difference. We can also look at the DN values. That is the pixel data. And you will notice that they have a uniform um, frequency.